chemical waste is sometimes illegally abandoned. These barrels appear to contain chemical waste, but we don't know what's in them. When the contents of a container are unknown, they are assumed to be hazardous. Hazardous materials are substances that can be dangerous to human health and safety. Professionals who investigate these materials form hazardous materials teams, which are also known as hazmat teams. Hazmat teams take all possible safety precautions when they handle unidentified waste. Abandoned waste can be found on empty lots, deserted factories, or remote parcels of land. Such waste should always be reported to local authorities, such as the fire department or police, so that it can be handled safely. In this case, a hazmat team responds to the call and then examines the barrel from a distance. Why doesn't the hazmat team go over to the barrel right away? Substances can be hazardous in many different ways. For example, they may be radioactive or explosive. Looking at the barrel from a distance can provide clues about what's inside. This information can be used to ensure the safety of people nearby. A hazmat investigator also takes all possible safety precautions. By wearing protective clothing and breathing oxygen from a tank, he is completely isolated from the outside environment. Instruments are used to measure the temperature of the barrel and to identify any fumes or vapors present. The barrel is opened only after the measurements indicate that there is no obvious danger. A sample of the waste from the barrel is then taken for on-site testing. pH paper is used to determine whether the waste is sufficiently acidic or basic to be corrosive. A flame test is conducted by placing a sample of the waste on a wire and burning the sample. The color of the flame identifies chemicals in the waste. The test results are compared to material safety data sheets and other information to identify the contents of the sample. When the identification is complete, the hazmat investigator calls to have the barrel transported to the appropriate disposal site.